So guys, this is Dr. Lior Barl here again. Let me just see if I can get this in focus. So you remember I did the review about the battery. I actually did a couple of seconds ago, but I'm releasing these videos every week. So I have to maintain it, like, you know, act like I've done it just like after three years. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. So anyways, what happens is I, you remember I asked without the charger because I don't believe in those foreign chargers. I do not like them at all to use them. Uh, so the thing is, uh, what I wanted to do is buy uh, a charger all on its own, a good charger that charges two batteries at a time. And voila, this is the best damn charger right now. You can get, there's so many companies that make all kinds of different chargers, but this one right here is the best because it also has voltage readouts and a bunch of other things. It is heavier than some of the other ones and it doesn't, you know, you're going to see it right now what I'm talking about. Um, here we go. Let me just open this. Okay. So this is how you see it comes with one of these right here. Not sure exactly what it's called. It's called a professional camcorder battery charger user man. Uh, well, this is the user manual. It's called the A, uh, A where is it here? AVNL 180. <laughs> And there's an AVNL1812. I'm not sure exactly what's that. Oh, I see, because this one comes with a XLR. But you could find this on Amazon.com for like $150. I mean, it's really cheap, you know, compared to all the other crap you're buying. And it's, uh, I bought it from an um, American store. Uh, I, like I said, guys, I really hardcore recommend that you buy as much as possible from uh, USA Made. I buy as much as I possibly can from the USA. Uh, of course, you know, if it's too expensive, you know, you got to look out for your dollar also. Uh, you know, if it's a little bit more expensive, I say go with that. If it's a lot more expensive, like for instance, you know, something else, you, you'd be better off, uh, you know, buying elsewhere. But, you know, try as much as possible to do that. Give me one second. We're back again. So as you can see, V-Lock batteries right here. So I'm going to be mounting these. Uh, here we go. I'm just going to... Oh. Here we go. Got this one in. Oops, sorry. Okay, got this one in. Let me get the other one in too. Gonna charge them both. So I like that they have like one is upside down, sort of like fraternal twins. <laughs> Hold on. Uh, here we go. Sorry for the camera movements, but it's got it got to happen. Uh, okay, so this is uh, basically you see they have the readout right here, and I'm gonna show you. I'm gonna turn it on. It says two channel sequence charger. Uh, operating instruction, whatever AC input, 100 to 240 volt, uh, DC output, 16.8 volt, uh, charge time, approximately five hours uh, for lithium ion uh, battery only for obviously V mount. But I am going to tell you it takes about uh, to charge both of them. What I've done is, uh, you know, my friend's one, it was about four hours. So, I mean, four hours on a charge on both of these babies is pretty cool. And when you're charging your, uh, I mean, when you're using this on the uh, Blackmagic camera, I have also what's called a, a battery uh, charger. Uh, yeah, I, I mean, a generator, an electronic generator that you, that uses the sun, the solar power, but also it can be charged over here in your home, which I'll be reviewing later. So while this, you pull this out, you have another five hours here. And if you have like a 15 hour shoot, you could charge this in the meantime while this one is still active. So, okay, and it comes with this right here, uh, which is obviously probably the, I'm guessing the adapter. Okay, so we're gonna check this out right here. I'm learning to do a lot of things with one hand here. Okay, <laughs> so you see a regular, just a regular cord which attaches right into there. And I'll be back in a second. I'll show you guys how it looks. Have a good one. Here we go, guys. I put the light on right here. So now I'm going to turn it on in the switch. See that? Now it's going to do the charge. But what I like about it is it reads... Uh, you're going to see that it re you see it reads the voltage it tells you exactly you know the voltage right here it tells you how, how, you know what's the percentage of the charge it's telling you pretty much everything you need to know which i really really do like now the other model that i was telling you about has a xlr port which is pretty darn cool now you see this this is the release button here you know so you got to press it down to remove it so it has a pretty good lock mechanism on it and you see it tells you like it, it actually changes you're going to see so it tells you this is 13.9 percent oops 14.62 volt voltage and it was just changing right now so it changes i guess see and now again it says charge 14.62 volt voltage 16 point i mean 14.62 volt that means these batteries are pretty much 
perfect uh perfect right now because they're about the same and they're charging right now so i'm gonna let it charge but as you guys can see it reads out like bad batteries good batteries and you know if you're getting ripped off or not when you first receive batteries and all that good stuff and you also know when they're gonna go bad which obviously it's not gonna go bad for a very long time so guys i do highly recommend uh getting these two batteries like i told you in the other video for 319 and then for this 150 bucks i mean on amazon.com or you could get it for 200 dollars the one with the xlr which i don't really care for uh uh, you know at all uh, so you know uh, let me know what you think uh, like dislike you know I'm getting my camera on Wednesday so I'll be doing an unboxing on that uh, hopefully release that sometime soon and then I'm gonna do a test on the on the camera itself and I'll show you guys low light setups all the all these different things I'm gonna show you about that camera and also I'm gonna be uh, releasing the tilt a cage video very soon I'm surprised nobody has that up yet but uh, I've done the tilt a battery uh, V mount which nobody had either so hopefully I mean this will help you guys out making a good decision this is a great great battery charger it cut it's all metal uh, construction I think it's probably you know I thought it was aluminum but it's metal uh, and it, it is heavy it has some girth on it you know, it's definitely heavy feels like one of those old-fashioned scales or <coughs> VCR but uh, it's not that that heavy you could still fit it in your backpack and have some fun with it but uh this is the best charger out there i have not seen they have those chargers that stand up uh i'm gonna tell you they take longer to charge and they don't have any readouts on them like this so i mean if you find anything that has readouts definitely go for it but hey 150 dollars where are you gonna find that you know what i mean with a simple uh cord that even if it blows out you which it won't you could get it it's like a computer cord and you could get it anywhere it's not like it's custom made so anyways let me know what you think like dislike uh comment below uh subscribe let me know what you think but definitely subscribe because i'm going to be doing a lot of unboxings especially uh, and a lot of product reviews for uh the black magic uh cinema camera since it's the same form factor and the black magic production camera 4k so uh let me know what you guys think have a good one take care bye